competitive center, jagging around with Peter Matthews Smith, King George, and Hamilton. What up? What up? Wait, we should high five. All right, right, yeah, let's do it. Yes. Listen, I feel odd saying jagging around yeah. in this beautiful area with you. You have three <laughs> names. That's something. Well, oh, no. when, you, when your name is Peter Smith, you know, equity rules, you know, you, you, yeah. you, there's another Peter Smith. Right. And so I need to extend my full name. So that's where the Peter Matthews Well, we were talking on the way here. Like, yeah. you know, sometimes I always forget names. Oh. So, we, so we would walk in and say, so how do you spell your last name? How do you name? spell your last name? And you'd be like, Smith, S-M-I-T-H. Yeah. We're like, is that with an I or a Yeah, <laughs> right. It's Silent not Smith. Right. Oh. Right, yeah. yeah. So tell us the story. You are the guy to get, as we said when you walked in, because <laughs> you are the Pittsburgh guy in the production that maybe people heard about at this point called Hamilton. Right. <laughs> So let's talk about your role in Hamilton as King yeah. George. This is you're, amazing. you're, you this is just kind of come in. You're like the field goal kicker in in the football game, right? You, you kind of yeah. At certain spots, Point. but it's the key spot, so the yeah. pressure's on you. And John is like, here he comes again. <laughs> yeah. So what is that like? It has to be. It's sort of the typical question, but we have to know what is it like to be from here and to kind of travel and enjoy everything about the production and then come back to it? Well, I mean, it's it's my, it's my honor to bring it back here. I mean, that's what's so great is when I saw the schedule and saw that we were going to be playing Pittsburgh, I was like, yes, right. yes, I get to bring it to Pittsburgh. So it was it was just it's so excited just to even see that. Sure. And now that we're here, it's, it's awesome, you know, like, uh, just being able to just walk around and know where I am. Yeah. You know, you go to cities and you're staying in the hotels and, and here I get to stay with my parents, you know, and, and then go to places I like to eat and, and, I, and I'm, everybody's asking me, where should I go? Say, yeah, I'm sure. Yeah. So yeah. What, I guess, what have you suggested? I mean, I've su I mean the, the, the typical, you know, Pramani's, yeah, you yeah. know, like Pamela's. And, and for nice stuff, just go up to Mount Washington, you know, find a nice restaurant up there. There's a bunch up there. You know, and then I'd say, go to the strip district, go, excuse me, go to the strip district, go to the south side if you want to drink. You know, like, <laughs> yeah. things like that. Yeah. yeah. You know, like I would say, did you? Mm. You know? Yeah. And, uh, really? You know, <laughs> like that. And, and, and I remember I had friends that would just make fun of me that weren't from Pittsburgh and, in college, and, and I'm, they're like, your accent? I'm like, I don't have an accent. It was also bizarre, too, because my parents aren't, they didn't grow up in Pittsburgh. So that's why it was easier for me to not have the accent so much, but the inflections that sunk in just living around here. You you picked that up. Yeah. And when you look yeah. at the North Shore, just it's amazing what's happened over on the North Shore. Like, yeah. You know, it used to be called the North Side, and now it's the North Shore with all these right. freaky things going on over there. I'm sure you, it's, it must be cool. How often do you get back to see to see how the change is occurring here? Well, I mean, the beautiful thing is that my parents and my wife's parents still live here in Pittsburgh. So, so we come back whenever we can. Uh, we live in Central PA. Mm -hmm. okay. Uh, my wife does morning news out okay. in Central PA, and um, and I mean I've only I've been doing this for a year now, so that's what's kept me away for a while. But when I wasn't doing this, we would come back okay. every every three or four weeks. Oh, okay, really? You know, to come home and and to be. In, but what is it like, obviously, having lived here, you know the transformation that we've seen every, with everything. Right. So what's it like to see these other cities? And, and Pittsburgh really does measure up at this point, right? Absolutely. And you know what? I, just yesterday, I was having a conversation uh, with Stephanie Umo, who plays uh, Angelica in the show. And she was saying, I love this city. Oh, that's fun. And she was like, it's great. And then all of a sudden, I was just chatting with her about how much I love it. And I'm like, I'm glad somebody else that's, that's not from here sure. appreciates it. Right. Because it truly is an amazing town. And, and I have traveled the country. I've done other tours before, too. And I always miss Pittsburgh. It's amazing. We don't realize what we have until we start traveling around the country and realizing, this is one of the best towns there is. Mm -hmm. and, and it's not even hometown pride. It, it's a true thing. Right. Yeah. That's why it always wins awards for being yeah. best ranked city for whatever. Right. You know, live, all these things. Yeah. It's true. Sure. It's a great town. <laughs>